Hey, what's up guys? So in this video, I'm going to walk you through how to use Comfy UI API. So I make a nicer wrapper with Bun and JavaScript. So you can see right here, I make it real elegant that you just call the function Q Comfy API and sending in the workflow and API JSON. And also, uh, we have, uh, the, the script help you override the input really easily. On the left side, you see the workflow here is an image input and just turning into a video just to test the video output and image input. And also I override the name to the API and uh, Comfy deploys the custom node that make it really easy to do so. So you can see if you just run the script and having Comfy UI open locally, uh, you can do that very easily. I'm gonna show you really quick um, right here as well. So this is the repository. Uh, I can simply run it with bun index.js. Zoom in a little bit. And you can see it's queuing the workflow at the output immediate dump here. Uh, let me delete this so that I can show you again. It's running the workflow immediately. I got the video with just one frame right here. And um, I can change out the input uh, just to show that it's actually doable. One random image is here. Paste it here. Sending a different image. Uh, yeah, one single frame. Perfect. So this actually works. And I'm going to walk you through quickly what is actually doing in it. So first, the function Q can be API, sending the inputs. Um, this is actually just calling the Comfy Deploy API in the custom node. So you have to make sure you have Comfy Deploy installed locally. Let me show you um, the Comfy Comfy instance here. So this is my Comfy local local Comfy instance with Comfy Deploy. You search Deploy. You can see it's right here. So we have custom route that make it much easier to call with uh, Comfy API. And on a high level, app shut everything away and basically just queue Comfy and then you download the file doing a polling to ensure the file is there. And you can imagine you can do a lot there, like different input and maybe like queuing the API um, with your custom interface. You can do quite a lot. And this all runs locally and you could deploy it to your own infrastructure. Uh, as long as you have a GPU instance there. So Comfy Deploy make it really easy to do that. Um, this video, I don't want to talk about the cloud instance, but if you want to do a cloud instance, you can also do that. But um, the major point of this video is like showing you, you can actually build quite a lot with just like running everything locally and pi piping this into your own custom API. You can wrap a really nice React front end. And um, if you're curious about hearing more of those, let me know in the comment. I'll do more videos. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.